folks, the Mets replay Deus Ex. And when last we left off, we have a super freighter to scuttle, and we shouldn't delay in doing so. Every minute we wait is another minute that MJ-12 has to prepare for infecting the United States with the Grey Death. But we need to be very careful as we proceed, as the people in here are very heavily armed. This person had a combat shotgun and lambs. The fact that he has lambs is quite useful because that means you can stock up on explosives while you're getting to the super freighter. There are actually quite a lot of opportunities to get explosives. Not in here though. These are locked with two lockpick strength doors, but they also have 25% door strength, which means we can use the dragon's tooth sword to smash these open, saving our precious lockpicks. As for what's in here, let's find out. The speed enhancement is fine for getting in. You could also get a very small box and use that, if you don't have the ability to jump higher. There's some assault rifle ammo, and a med kit. Nothing really useful there. But what about in here? We have some shotgun ammunition, sniper rifle ammunition, and more shotgun ammo. Which reminds me, I only have three shots in this. I should remember that. Now there's another one of these that we can open. Hopefully this one... Ooh. I have begun planning your future objectives. Dow will be sending you to Paris. Make sure he gives you the current residence of his associate, Morgan Everett. I do not have access to that information. Information you don't have access to, eh? It must be very well guarded. There are some things here that we want. A bioelectric cell, a lockpick, and a weapon mod for range. Ooh, that's pretty good. Let's drop this and grab this. Now we can put this on the sniper rifle or the pistol. We could put it on the uh, gap gun, but it's really wasted on that. I'm actually going to put this on the sniper rifle and see how many skill points I have. Ooh, I have loads of skill points right now. Enough to get master in rifle. There. An agent can take down a target a mile away with one shot. And we have 910 skill points left. I'm not quite sure what I want to spend those on. I might actually put them into swimming. I usually don't, but I might. Underwater operations require their own unique set of skills that must be deployed by an agent with extreme physical dedication. The more points you put in, the faster you can swim, and the better your lung capacity is. For now, I think I'll save these points and move on. Now we can go into here, and there are quite a few goodies that we can grab. There are also some people that we'll need to take out. And a camera we need to be wary of. We want to turn off those cameras. Now you are not hostile. So let's go over to here, and see about getting to the blind spot of the camera, like so. Let's check this computer, see if there's anything interesting to read. There might be. We have something uh, about the bots. They're being serviced on bi-weekly rotating intervals. Fair enough. A Grey Death reminder. That's ominous. And ASF clearances. Fair enough. Now, are there any goodies in here that I can get? There's a data cube. Once on site, you are to assume control of the Brooklyn Naval Shipyard security system and link it with the FEMA presence already there. Login is US FEMA and password is security. When the task is completed, report to Simons. Fair enough. I'm half tempted to uh, turn this off, but there is another way I could do that. It's called the Sniper Rifle. It's powerful enough now that we can take out security cameras with a single shot. Now this is locked, but we should be able to open it and get the Truck Trailer's Parking Lot Key. A little late for that, and there's nothing in there of particular importance. Ooh, there's something here that we can read though. 
No further notice or access to the advanced submarine facility is restricted to FEMA and authorized security personnel only. Security should consider themselves on high alert. All entrances have been sealed and the codes will change daily. Today's code is 0909. You will receive future codes from your direct superior. This code is not to be divulged to any individual who is not authorized security or FEMA. Well, you really shouldn't have left that there. I wonder if that's gonna work here. No. And that set off the alarm, which is not great. This is locked, but, oh hello. Please don't notice me. Excellent. Glad you didn't. One less person to worry about, and all you had was a knife that I can pick up. Don't want that. Can I destroy this door? No. I probably could with an explosive, though. Probably could. Let's see what's behind there. I have a lot of rockets. One shouldn't be missed. There we go. 20 skill points for an accomplishment. Have we attracted some undue attention? Well, you're going to panic, but I'm sure you'll calm down. Ooh, in here are quite a few goodies. What have we got? Ooh, you heard something, did you? Please come and investigate. I'm not going to. Ooh, white phosphorus rockets. Marvelous. Gonna run all the so way around. Right Hello! One. Goodbye! You really shouldn't have engaged me, should you? There's also here. Marvelous. Destroying that gave me access to the security system. I'm gonna hack this for sure. Ooh, robot standby. We could get the robots to attack everyone. But I don't feel like doing that. Let's keep them off open this, we'll set the uh, turret to enemies, and the turret to enemies. There's also a lamb there that we need to watch out for, and goodies here. This one is locked. That's okay. Ooh, key to supply closet and key to commander's office. Both of those are going to be useful. Now let's see about looking around in here. And talking to you two. Hello. Haven't seen you in a week. Where you been? Ah, workers camp. Messed up my hand while I was working on the sewer shutoff grate. Damn thing came down and nearly took off my whole arm. Gonna be all right? Yes, okay. They told me they were gonna fix it. Of course, they waited until after I got hurt to do it. I, uh, saw a bunch of folks working on that shed out back a few days ago. Figured they must be tinkering with the control valve, sure enough. What's up with this place anyway? On the way in, some goon with a gun frisked me from head to toe, told me to watch my step. FEMA, sure. After they declared martial law, they came down in this place like they owned it. Shut off the sub pin, threatened to shoot anyone got close. Yeah, I saw him goose stepping around back there. Christ, this place is going to hell in a handbasket real fast. Wonder what the union's got to say. Right now, the union ain't got nothing to say. Nothing to say at all. Hello. Hey, I know my job. You want something else out of me? Talk to the Union. I don't have the Union's number. Could you give it to me? Place has turned into a military camp. You're gone one week, this is what happens. Martial law's hitting this place hard. Look, you do what you have to do, I'll do what I have to do. I'm just saying I don't trust a bunch of guys with riot gear and guns. And you trust me? I have a pistol, a sawed-off shotgun, a sniper rifle, a gep gun, a light anti-tank weapon, and a nanotech sword. Why do you trust me? I ain't done nothing wrong, so just leave me alone, okay? I will. Don't worry, I just want to see if you have anything else to say. If you're gonna bust my ass, I'm gonna quit right now. Go ahead. I don't even work here. Hey, I know my job. You want something else out of me? Talk to the Union. Hello. You supposed to be taking over around here? Sure, if that means you'll give me all of your keys and the access codes. Don't mind me saying so. You can't be worse than the other guy. Simons. That's his name. Simons isn't a very nice person. I, uh, I don't want to be getting anyone into trouble, but there's something about the man that just ain't trustworthy. There are many things about that person that's not trustworthy. Like what? 
Don't know exactly. Had this way of talking like you'd just as soon wring your neck if he didn't need you for the job. Yep, that sounds like Simon's. Strange tattoos kind of swim around under his skin. I ain't seen nothing like it. They're not tattoos. Got work to do, sure enough. That you do. Keep staring at that wall, doc worker. Check in with the front office if you need to know anything else. I'd better not. They'll probably try and shoot me. Look, I'm done jawing. I got five hours left on my shift. All right, I'll leave you be. Good luck. Now, we've got a few places that we can go to, like upstairs. Let's pop up and... Oh, hello. How are you? Just take care of you. This gun now, really powerful. Really powerful indeed. It deals the uh, damage is... Base damage plus 50% to 37. This gun, by the way, same base damage. I'm going to grab these, and we're going to throw them down. We're also going to grab these rockets. See what's within. An assault shotgun. Don't need that. And... Where did that one go? Okay, that one just vanished into thin air. Hopefully there was nothing especially... Oh, no, wait! It was in my hands, I just couldn't see it. And I thought it had disappeared. Ooh, lots of Sabot shells. We actually have a full load of them. Now, there's a camera there, and it doesn't look like there's anything really good in there now. Hello! Ooh, look at that big robot there. We're gonna have to take care of you, but first, we'll deal with you. Don't want you trying to get me. Ooh, another lamb. Do we have a key for this? We don't have a key for this. Okay, so we're gonna have to find another way in. That's not a problem, it shouldn't be too difficult. Go down here, and this way. We do need to watch out for that giant robot. Now we should be able to get that open somehow. Do we have the key for this? No, we don't. But maybe we don't need the key. Because we can just smash this and go in this way. If we can position ourselves correctly. Not like that we can't. Okay. Can we just smash down the door? Not like that we can't. Okay, we could get a small box and use that to get in. That's probably a better idea. No small boxes here. There's probably a small box or two. Yep, there's a small box or two in here that we can grab. Like that one there. Don't mind me. I'm just going to get out of the way. I'm using this to sneak in here so I don't have to waste any of my lockpicks or any of my explosives. We're going to need those explosives. For all of our augmentations, sometimes it's the mundane solutions that are, oh, that are best. You're going to set off the alarm? No, no, you're not. Right, we need to get rid of you. And you know what? Best way to do that? You're gone now. Much better. Now let's get a light on in here. Brilliant. Now we can see things. Nothing good in there. That one is locked. One lock pick. We may think about it if, uh, if we find more lock picks around. Bioelectric cells. Those aren't so bad. But we don't necessarily. Ooh, well, there's a lock pick. So we're gonna be opening up this, aren't we? Why not? What's in here that's so good? Ooh, a data cube. Okay, I've added a new account for our friendly neighborhood FEMA rep. It's only temporary, but it should allow him to check his email and all that. Let him know we're behind a firewall, so if he wants to access any PrivNet stuff, that'll take some working out with IS. Login Walton, password Simons. See you in the morning, Josie. That's a terrible password. Hey Ben, how's it going? Yes, the stuff with the Grey Death is really troubling. Leave the Super Freighter to me, Ben. I know you could take care of it, but it's best that I do it. You maintain this cover and see if you can get any information about what Walton Simons is planning next. Alright? Alright. I have few people I can trust anymore. 
make sure you get out of here if things get too dangerous, all right? Take care of yourself. We need to keep looking around. Ooh, something else that we can smash open. Binoculars. Add that to the number of binoculars that you can pick up. And if I move this to here, I can smash this and get some money. 100 credits. As to what's in here, candy. Ooh, something in here. A med kit. Don't really need that. And here's an image from Millennium Magazine. I might have already seen that. I think I actually have. Now let's log in with Walton and Simons. Not on this computer. This computer? Walton... Simons? No. Let's just hack it and see if there's anything that we haven't already seen. No, nothing we haven't already seen. There's also this security terminal. Probably should have checked this out as opposed to getting rid of the camera with the sniper rifle, but it didn't really hurt. Turn this off, open this up. We'll also open this up as well, and we want that open. Three picks or 50%. Three picks or 50%, and the sword. Nope, that's not going to do anything here, so you know what? Let's use this. Watch out, Ben. Good. You were unharmed. Now let's... Ooh, let's look at all the goodies here. What have we got? 10 millimeter ammo, a multi-tool, and a small amount of ammunition, as well as ballistic armor. As for what's in here, we have... Ooh, 20 skill points. That's nice. Ooh, a weapon mod. And a key. Weapon storage closet. And even more money. As well as a safe. Hmm. The safe might have something good in it. From Walton Simons to Paul Jenkins. During my review of security measures this morning, I noticed a potential hole in the security office of the East Warehouse. Please change this code immediately to 2249. We will pursue a more thorough solution at a later date. Walton Simons. Also, probably best to turn my light on. Would have saved me a little bit of bioelectric energy. Page unveils Aquinas. Ooh, newest technological achievement. The result of over 500 man years of effort. This thing is going to be interesting. Bandwidth is now, for all intents and purposes, free. But probably with a downside. Now let's type in that password. Not Waltken. I don't know who Waltken is. Ah, here we go. Preparations. Some information about the plan here. A security request that probably isn't going to be fulfilled. I have looking for that traitor, J.C. Denton or Kikoskia or whatever he calls himself, but he is not in Hong Kong. I am to be returning to New York, but I will find him. Thank you for this mission. It is what I want. I will succeed for you and for Agent Navara. Gunther Herman. The Versalife situation has been corrected. All evidence of MJ-12 involvement has been removed prior to the building being demolished. Looks like they're covering their tracks and trying their best to implicate us. Not surprising they're trying to implicate us. Now we could use another explosive to gain access to this. We also want to use this reload mod on the shotgun. The shotgun has a really impressive reload time now. Another explosive or... you know what? I have plenty of these. I'll be finding more, so let's actually use three lockpicks to get into here and see what is worth hiding behind such a secure safe. Ooh. An augmentation canister. If you needed aqualung or environmental resistance, it's here. As it stands, we don't need either of them, so that was a wasted effort. I think we've done all we want to here, so actually open the door from inside, which is unfortunate. 
Can we slowly... Aha! If we slowly push this couch over here, we can use that to get out. JC Denton, always ingenious in his solutions. <gasps> there we go. <gasps> Brilliant. Ah! They're hostile. I thought they might be. That's not good. I could set them to standby mode. That's probably a good idea. Probably a really good idea. Now, I believe the panel was in here. If we set them to standby, they shouldn't be hostile to me. Robots in standby mode. Let's see if that has made a difference. I don't want to waste my explosives on them, after all. Are they still active? No, they're not. You... maybe? No, actually, you are now not active. Good to know. There's a camera there. Gonna have to watch out. Uh-oh! Never mind! You won't believe this, JC. There was a raid on smugglers. I just saw Gunter get into a copter on the roof and head back to Yonatko. I don't think Smuggler got out in time. Just thought you might want to know. What? You mean that Yonatko did end up attacking Smuggler after all? Oh no! He's dead! If only there was some way that I could have saved him. If only there was a way. And so, when we come back, folks, we're currently pinned into this room by these robots, who actually are hostile and active. We're gonna have to deal with them, aren't we? Yes, we are. It's a good thing I have lots of explosives to do so. I should also open these up. Ooh. TNT. That'll be quite useful. Very useful indeed. And way for us to get up to there as well. Gonna have to use that. And so, I'll catch you next time, folks, and I'll see you then. Later. Should probably also turn off this as well, so that the alarm doesn't go off and get us into even more trouble. We can set the robots to standby again and turn off that camera. Hopefully that will do the trick. It probably won't but it might. Later.